Alright guys, before today's video starts, I think the VMP might be the best SMG in the game. But if you don't believe me, just ask this guy. Right, hello guys, and welcome to today's video. I hope you enjoyed that little intro clip there with the guy raging and everything. He didn't like getting turned on and destroyed by the VMP here, but as you can see, I think the VMP is the best SMG in Black Ops 4. So today, we are doing a class up with it because we did manage to get lucky enough to get it out of a uh, weapon crate. So as you can see on the screen, today's video is the VMP with long bow, quick draw, and fast mags. That is what I believe is the best attachments and best class setup possible for the VMP. So do try it out. I also had the RK7 Garrison Mastercraft as my secondary, just because I had an extra point and there's no point putting a sight on this. And plus, I like to have my perks, you know, Scavenger, Gunho, Dead Science. I love to have that set up. But do try out this class setup if you do have this gun. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Today's video is absolutely insane gameplay with the VMP. And yeah, let's get right into today's gameplay. Right, hello guys, and welcome to today's video. In today's video, you're going to be seeing as a Black Ops 4, probably my final Black Ops 4 video, but today's video is going to be a Black Ops 4 best class setup for the VMP. That's right, the VMP. I probably won't be doing the A94 on that because I don't have any weapon bribes left. I only had one weapon bribe and luckily out came the VMP. Nothing like the Havelino or that, so I didn't get something that I didn't want. We actually got, I, I, to be honest, I wanted this weapon. When I heard the VMP was coming to this game, I kind of wanted it. So I went on back on the game, I opened up my supply drop, and what do you know, luckily the VMP came out and this thing is a beast and I'm going to say it right now, this is probably the best SMG in the game, you're going to see, look at the kill time, look just unbelievable, the fire rate's fantastic, the recoil on it's fantastic, it's kind of like what it was in Black Ops 3, an absolute monster of an SMG. Now in Black Ops 3 this was the best SMG, not sure after when Black Ops 3 was done because obviously they released uh, weapons after that but I know they did nerf the VMP in that game when uh, that game was said and done, but they brought the VMP back, it's here in Black Ops 4, you know, recycled content as usual, but I'm not complaining, I'm going to be honest, this is something that I kind of ex would accept in this game, because it's pretty cool, I like this weapon, VMP was a very cool weapon. Not my favourite SMG of all time, but it's definitely my second favourite SMG of all time. Number one being the MSMC, so if you got to use the MSMC, trust me you'll love it, but we're not talking about the MSMC, we're going to be talking about the VMP. So I'll probably do an intro clip, explain the class setup, but the class setup as you guys will know, is quick draw, long barrel, and fast mags. So I'll start with one thing. The one most important attachment I think on this gun is actually the fast mags. Now you're probably thinking, Tess, that doesn't change anything though. That only changes your reload speed. That doesn't help you kill fast or anything like that. You're right. But the reload without fast mags is incredibly slow. Like it is very slow. And as you can see, the, the damage this thing puts at range is unbelievable. The fire rate, fantastic. This gun doesn't have rapid fire, but that's okay, we don't need rapid fire. Again, the fire rate is fantastic. Basically, if you want to compare this gun to another gun, this is basically the Sork 2.0, but a little bit better. Just a little bit better. Just because of the things it can do, the things it can have, and I think the fire rate's a little bit better. I think, I'm not sure, but I know the range of the gun is definitely better. That is one thing you'll notice, especially with the fact they can have long barrel, because the Sork cannot have long barrel. But this having long barrel makes the damage all that, all that much better, it really does. So you're going to see in this gameplay as well, we are rocking some meaty kill streaks. UAV, not too meaty, but we need it. Unluckily I get quail there, I didn't look there and that was my fault. But we have a UAV. The Jimmy's and Jeffries, aka the Taz Juniors on the map. And as you can see, the most overpowered score streak in the game. The gunship. Now I say overpowered, to be honest, this is the only one where you get like absolutely rewarded for. Because you know the amount of things in this game with people using launchers and people using titans with FMJ2 and... The Paladin with FMJ2 take out score streaks very quick, but you can't take this out very quick. And plus, by the time you try to take me out, I've probably already killed you. So yeah, the gunship absolutely beastly streak. Gonna miss this thing. Hopefully, Modern Warfare will have some good kill streaks. I did obviously play the Bayer, and there were some good kill streaks, but I'm hoping there are some better ones because I'm, I'm sure there's more in the full game. But we will see. But absolutely insane game. But you're gonna see we put up an absolute insane score line here as well. But yeah. The gunship, when you spawn, you die. That's literally how the gunship works. You spawn, you die. You spawn, you die. But yeah, the VMP. Absolutely, 100% the best SMG in the game, by far. And it's a shame it was added at such a, 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 such a, like, a dead point of the game, I'd say. Because I'll be honest, I haven't played this game a lot since, and I probably won't be playing it 
anymore, really. You know, I, I can still get the uh, second weapon bribe and try and get the AN-94 or whatever else I haven't got. But I don't think I'm really that interested. I don't know if you guys are interested anymore. I know I know Black Ops 4 is kind of just meh to people now. You know, people are kind of waiting for MW. They're hoping for MW to come out. Well, hoping it is coming out, but... Yeah, people are just waiting for MW now, and I am too. But don't worry, guys. I have MW gameplays. Those will be coming up soon. But I had to share this one. I, I, wa I wanted to use the VMP. When I got the VMP, I just had to use it. And it's an insane, insane SMG. Definitely the best SMG in the game, so I do hope you have it. If you are still playing Black Ops 4, uh, try out my class setup. Quick draw, long bow, and fast mags. I would say as well, this gun does not need a uh, grip. If you can understand the uh, recoil pattern, you definitely do not need a grip. Basically, the tip to using this gun is just pull slightly down to the bottom left, because I believe the recoil goes up to the right. So as long as you pull slightly down to the left, you'll be fine. There'll be no need to use grip. I did try things out like that, I tried grip and that. Grip does make a difference, but it's definitely not needed, as you can see in this gameplay. My VMP, VMP shot was just on point, it was crisp as anything. Also my scythe shot was on point, they haven't nerfed this, and well, clearly at this point it's not getting nerfed, so... If you guys are still playing Black Ops 4, when MW is out, because I don't know, for whatever reason you might not want to play MW, or you're just not getting MW, uh, just use the scythe, <laughs> just use the scythe, they're clearly not going to nerf it, it looks like. I don't know if they're going to do anything with this game after MW comes out. I really don't think they will. I think they're too busy making Black Ops 5 or Black Ops or whatever their next game is called. Who knows? Hopefully it's a good game. But for now, we are getting prepared for MW. I do have MW content still coming. Unluckily, we get taken out there. Guy also using a VMP, so if that doesn't show you how OP it is, the only way to use a VMP is to use a VMP. Also, I forgot as well, I'm probably going to add a little intro clip Showcasing to you guys the uh, VMP, how good it is. So uh, I hope you enjoyed the guy's rage reaction to how good the VMP is. But yeah, that was a funny moment whilst I was trying to get attachments. You'll see in that little intro clip, before the other intro clip, talking about the class setup, that uh, the VMP was pretty good and uh, the guy wasn't very happy that he got... I'll just say world star, shall we say. He, he kind of got destroyed. But you're going to see, we pull out another gunship, we have another set of Jimmys and Jeffries, aka the Taz Juniors, the final set of Black Ops 4's Jimmys and Jeffries, aka Taz Juniors, coming to this channel. It's a sad time, guys. The end of the Jimmys and Jeffries. I want to see a rip to the Jimmys and Jeffries in the comment section, guys, but I hope you're going to enjoy today's video. I hope you I hope you have the VMP, if you are still playing, because try it out. It's, it's a lot of fun. It's, a, it's something to do before MW comes out. It's a really fun weapon. It's just exactly the same as it was in Black Ops 3, an absolute monster, an absolute beast, and you're going to see the gameplay is wrapping up soon, but absolutely insane. And yeah, that intro clip, man, that guy raging was hilarious, honestly, I had to include that little intro clip. But yeah, 3, 2, 1, and here you are, VMP gameplay, we went 70 and 2, almost 10,000 damage with this VMP best class setup, so I hope you enjoyed today's gameplay, I hope you enjoyed what is possibly my final Black Ops 4 video, but I hope you enjoy it, and uh, leave a comment, leave a like, subscribe, subscribe notifications on, I'll catch you guys in the next video, goodbye!